types of mining. Metallic minerals that are found in their raw state with impurities are called ores. To extract metal content out of an ore, impurities have to be removed. They are rarely found near the surface of the earth. They are extracted from deep within the earth. This process of extraction of minerals from the earth's depth is known as mining and the opened up hole is a mine. To extract minerals from earth, a deep hole is dug to reach them and bring them out. These holes are called shafts or tunnels and the mines are termed deep shaft mines. When minerals are found on the earth's surface, an open pit is dug to extract minerals. These pits are called open cast mines or quarries. Open cast mines is a common method of coal mining in India. To extract oil and natural gas, deep wells are dug. The oil wells of Oil and Natural Gas Corporation, ONGC, in India are very good examples of such wells. Conservation of Minerals Minerals are a declining resource because the natural replacement of minerals takes a much longer period of time. The demand for minerals is increasing and as such large deposits of minerals are being exhausted due to continuous mining. The extraction of mineral resources from the earth is called robber industry as the extraction is robbing the earth of its mineral resources. Both metallic and non-metallic minerals take thousands of years to form in the earth and hence need to be conserved to be available for use in future. The three basic principles of conservation apply to minerals too. The three R's namely reduce, reuse and recycle are the most important guidelines. We should find alternative methods to reduce the use of minerals. Some good examples of this are the use of carbon fibers in place of aluminium and other expensive metals in automobile bodies and in construction of aircrafts. We should also avoid unnecessary use of mineral products to conserve them. Example, to conserve mineral oil and natural gas, we should keep our vehicles maintained so that they remain fuel efficient and avoid unwanted use of our vehicles. We should also check wasteful methods of cooking to save natural or petroleum gas. Most of the metals and even some non-metals can be reused to save mining and production of fresh minerals. The best examples are metal parts and objects such as old and damaged machinery, broken tools, broken metal utensils, used metal fittings such as clips, brackets, etc. All these can be repaired, painted and maintained to be successfully reused. Used engine oil and lube are good examples of non-metals that can be reused as lubricants in home and industrial appliances. All metal products and a variety of non-metal products can be recycled to make new metallic and non-metallic products, aluminium, copper, iron, gold, silver, tin, zinc, lead, etc. and their alloys can be melted and recycled to make new things and products. Similarly, glass, paper, cement, etc. are some common examples of non-metal products that can also be successfully recycled to make fresh products.